paper, scissors, shoot. I, uh, I was told that AHS could help me get a vodka. Where are you guys taking me? So you say you need a locker without any clue You gotta get your head together before you pursue If hazardous chems are your research game Then lockers need to be worn or else you're lame And don't forget about the BO2 The microbugs and critters are after you So get your lab coat on for growing cells And when you see this sign, it should ring a bell And when you open a jaw of radioactive Wear a lab coat or the gal put you in captain The EHS rules are just the minimum lore Check out your TPT guide if you wanna learn more that's right, the laboratory is a danger zone And so you need a lab coat for protection And if you work in the laboratory, lab coat less How could you call yourself a scientist? What you doing wearing them shorties and flops? Just a lab coat ain't gonna protect them socks Get your long pants on and close toe shoes And with your lab coat on, you're gonna lose First step first when I walk through the door I grab my polycop blue and into the floor I go to my fume hood for some extra protection Goggles, face shield, gloves, and I'm ready for action When you use your lab coat, be sure it's closed It's your chemical bin for when you get hosed And like a club party, research has the bump which spreads the BL to you as easy as nothing That's right, when you're in a lab It's your life on the line So wear a lab coat like your friend of mine And if you work in the laboratory lab coat less How could you call yourself a scientist? You can't just pick any coat, you need a style So listen real close to what we have to say Standard choice is white, poly, cot, or just straight up cot Good for BL work, non corrosive and non-flammables. For flammables and open flames, use a blue treated cot. For serious pyrophorics, get a no mex coat. Keep in mind these coats ain't fluid resistant. They also don't hold up against corrosives. So for the specialty of work, be sure to do your research, check out the EHS site, and buy the special gear. Coats come in a variety of styles, tight cuffs for the wrists and snaps for the quick strip. Give your coat a try on to see if it fits properly. Too big and you'll be doing your research sloppily. When in doubt about where you needed a lab coat, seek EHS and they'll come to help you out. Wait, you're not EHS? Take a note here, get for the hazard splash. You want to remove your lab coat in a flash. And don't try to clean your coat at home. Use a laundering service or send it to Rome. In case of a fire, you stop on the roll. If you wait too long, you'll take a toll. And your lab mates help you take a safety shower and full chemical splashes to a quarter hour. Don't feel bad if your coat takes a beating. Accidents happen and that is the need. That's right, lab coat is just a first line of defense Don't feel ashamed to rip it off The laboratory is a danger zone And so you need a lab coat for protection And if you work in the laboratory, lab coat less How could you call yourself a scientist?